This short video provides a quick overview of the basic parts of a typical medical isolated power system served by an isolated power panel board. Here are the fundamental components. A typical medical isolated power panel consists of the following parts. The enclosure, made up of the box and cover, an isolation transformer, a panel interior with circuit breakers, the connector plate and wiring harness, and the line isolation monitor. In addition to the isolated power panel, a remote indicator for status monitoring remotely is a common additional component. Particularly with older systems, the remote indicator may be found in the panel cover. The purpose of this not very remote remote indicator is to provide ready access to basic system monitoring and control when other components are inaccessible behind the locked door of the isolated power panel board. Other components may also include single or duplex receptacles, color-coded to indicate isolated power, and ground jacks for grounding of portable equipment. Both isolated power receptacles and ground jacks are typically included with an isolated power system. Their inclusion in the cover of the isolated power panel itself is optional. Lastly, some isolated power systems may include a higher voltage portion furnished either as part of a dual voltage panel or as a separate higher voltage panel. The higher voltage portion of a medical isolated power system provides power for x-ray and surgical laser equipment. This equipment is commonly portable and special receptacles are needed to serve them. These x-ray and laser receptacles because of their higher power requirements are typically incorporated into a special type of isolated power panel board called a controlled power panel.